So, my, <laughs> been doing the keto diet. Do you guys know what the keto diet is? Yeah! Okay. So if you don't know, my, my girl heard about it on the Jersey Shore. And it's 75% fat, 20% protein, 5% carbs. So I'm just, I'm putting butter in everything. I'm drinking butter in my coffee. Just fat, 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 nom, 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 nom. Bacon, 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 fat, 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 nom, 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 nom. After three months, it was like, you know what? Maybe I should go to the doctor. And so I went to get a blood test. And while I was there, I was like, hey, let's throw in an AIDS test while I'm here. Right? Uh, I've, I've been monogamous for four years, but there's, I grew up in the 80s, so it was like everybody was like, everybody's got AIDS in the 80s. And I've always just thought that there might be some AIDS hiding out behind a red blood cell, like, blah, 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 still here. <laughs> and I tr when I was dating, I tried to be responsible. I wore condoms, but there's a lot of broken condoms in my story. And uh, let's face it, folks, nobody stops when a condom breaks. Nobody stops. That You look down, and that's just God's way of being like, well, you tried. Uh, <laughs> like, if you're playing football and your helmet gets knocked off, you finish that fucking play, right? You go until you hear that whistle. And, and dudes, we're such psychos that we take credit for it when the condom breaks. It wasn't a faulty prophylactic. We look down and it's just like, oh, you couldn't handle all this dick? Ah, stay breaking condoms, right? We're psych we are psychos. And it feels great when you break that bitch, right? But you look down, you feel like you just turned into the Incredible Hulk. Like, ah! It's all in tatters, Hulk smash rubber, girl next. Like, <laughs> so I get the blood test and <laughs> I got it on a Thursday. <laughs> Friday, I get a call from my doctor's office saying, Mr. Redding, we need you to come in to discuss your results. And I was like, I was like, oh my, am I, am I, am I, am I HIV positive? She's like, I can't discuss results over the phone. You need to come in. So I spent the entire weekend with full-blown AIDS. Full-blown. I, I was in full immunocompromise. I, <coughs> I was fucked up. And my girl is like, what's wrong? Like, nothing. Don't worry, nothing's wrong. Nothing at all. Because I can't tell her about this shit, right? She's a doctor. I can't just be like, just pull a fast one on her like, oh, yeah, I probably got it from the toilet seat. No. Like, oh, you don't remember when I got that blood transfusion in Haiti? Like, there's, there's no fool in this broad. I go in on Monday, dead man walking. I'm ready to just get my bad news and... She says, Mr. Redding, your cholesterol has tripled. And I said, yes! Fuck yeah! And, and she's like, no, you are at a six times greater risk of having a heart attack. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. I don't have AIDS. I don't have AIDS. Who's fucking tonight? Who's fucking tonight? I <laughs> I told that story. What's that? <laughs> <laughs>